beautiful way to end the week. Mama Swan and her <laughs> tiny babies were seen enjoying the spring weather this afternoon near a pond in Chestnut Hill. People in the area say these adorable babies were born sometime last week. Tis the season for all that around here. Oh. 4.18 in the afternoon, Mr. Bouchard is with us as we have once again made it to Friday. Yes. Yeah, we're here. Um, so not bad. Uh, the weekend is uh, kind of a split. Right. It doesn't look all that bad. Uh, Saturday better than Sunday, but you know, we'll manage. Uh, pollen count remains up. It's spring in New England, right? This is how we do it. Uh, temperature 52 right now in Boston, 54 in Beverly. Marshfield 52 degrees. Water temp hasn't really moved over the last couple of weeks. It's 48 degrees. And so when the wind blows off of that, a couple of things happen. It cools the temperatures right at the surface, but also as the wind blows over the ocean, it picks up water vapor and it gives us cloud cover. If you watch the satellite imagery this morning, and I know you did, I know you looked at it. Not really. Um, it fed the clouds. It was feeding them. And then we offset it with sunshine. The sun angle's high enough to actually fry some of those clouds and dry out um, the atmosphere. Anyway, split weekend, uh, wet afternoon on Sunday. So is it noontime or is it two o'clock? Is it three o'clock? I think around three ish. We'll get our first drops and then going through the afternoon, the rain sets in and steady at times too. an unsettled pattern starting midweek next week. But that does not tell the whole tale of next week because we have a couple of really mild days coming up. And you can see there's mild air all around us. Well, just to the west in Buffalo and, of course, back in Albany, about 73 degrees right now. Syracuse, Rome, mid-70s. The warm front is kind of hung up here. It's more of a stationary front than it is a warm front, and it's really sitting on our sea breeze. So tonight, okay, partly cloudy, but you can see the clouds come in. Ah, it's the easterly wind. There it is into tomorrow and the clouds do tighten up eventually and we go overcast. But I still have optimism for at least some sunshine coming through those clouds tomorrow and our forecast getting back up into the lower 50s. We have that. And then away from the coast, we still have a chance to get near 60 degrees. That's through Framingham, Natick and Marlboro. And then mid 60s, a possibility from about Lemonster to Fitchburg and out through Jaffa, New Hampshire. So we're coolest along the coastline, just like today. It's almost a carbon copy. And with a little bit of sunshine, it feels tolerable. Good for yard work, if you want to golf, do whatever. Temperatures on Sunday come down a little bit, back into those middle 50s. We could have a little window of sunshine. I'm playing that optimistically, and it's early in the morning, 7 to 9 o'clock. And then we go into the overcast. That's fragile. I'm not going to promise that. We could wake up with overcast and just stay cloudy in many spots on Sunday. It's odd because the showers are just to the west, but we're going to hold them back for the weekend? Yeah, for a good part of it. A lot of these will fizzle as they come eastbound. You can already see that happening. So a new renewed area of rain will be ours for Sunday. And Sunday's forecast has us right there early in the morning. That's 4 a.m. to 5 a.m. And then swinging down the pike, coming right at us. But it crawls. So here we're buying time again. And then we go into the overcast and a couple of sprinkles come our way by three or four. And then the steady rain thereafter. Pollen count, by the way, is moderate on Sunday, comes down thanks to the showers in the forecast. The extended forecast, not all that grand, honestly, except for Monday and Tuesday. If you have those days off, wow, that's awesome. Maybe morning sprinkle, but temps are in the 70s. Don't know what that's like. But Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, oh my gosh, in the next weekend, mm, the temperature's amazing. a little drab too. We're back at 4 30. Yeah, I think I have a slight tickle in my throat. Oh, do you now? I might have to just, you know. Nope. This is mm -mm. me telling our managers I might have a cold on Monday and Tuesday. <laughs>